Okay, this is my review of the Daystate Wolverine 303. I want to start on the back. This butt piece is adjustable. However, it slides only up and down. This is where you can adjust it. If you see the little notch here, it does slide up and down. The stock, the walnut stock is, it's incredible. I mean, it's just a gorgeous piece of wood here. If you look at the Daystate logo, you'll have the tank gauge on the bottom the trigger on this is awesome can't believe how smooth that trigger is this top block here is made out of titanium the lever is smooth no clunks. Let's pull it back, slide it back in. Incredible. The rifle weighs nine and a half pounds with the scope. It's a little bit uh, heavier, but I tell you, it just fits. Well, anyway, for me, you know, the first time I picked it up, it's just it was so well balanced that I found it, you know, very comfortable. I uh, I added a ho uh, <coughs> Hawk Optics uh, Eclipse 30 millimeter side focus with a mil dot reticle. This scope is awesome. Let me tell you, it's crystal clear. Uh, you know, it has six by twenty four. With a 50 millimeter, uh, 50 millimeter AO. I mean, the glass is just, it's so clear. You know, anything long distance, you can just see like, you know, it's like, uh, you know, right there. Wolverine HP 303. Okay. Here goes the 300cc tank. It's quiet. It's a quiet rifle, let me tell you, with the moderator on it. Let me, I'm going to try to zoom in. What I'd like you to see how gorgeous this thing is. Okay, see the the moderator. This moderator comes off. All you gotta do is twist it off. Slide it right out. You got the 303 barrel. This here comes off. That's where you uh, plug in the air, fill it up. When you buy the rifle, it comes with the uh, comes with the adapter valve. Okay, snaps that back in. This here is the uh, five shot cartridge. And here you got the Emperor 303 pellets, 50 grains.
want you to see that. That's the 50 grains right there. Okay. These are the Emperor pellets. Let me just show you what it looks like. Okay, so as I was saying, here you have the five shot cartridge. And all you gotta do is load it in, just drop it in all the way. Once it's seated in, pull back. All the way back. And you slide the cartridge in, and it's ready. There is a safety lever, which is this knob right here, which I have my thumb on. You slide it to the right, it's hot. To the left, it's locked. Another nice feature is the actual, the grip. You know, this is textured, and then you have the thumb, the thumb grip on the top. So when you actually pull the trigger, you're holding it like this. That's the way you're going to hold a rifle. It's supposed to be better for uh, accuracy. And like I said, the, 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 with the moderator on, the rifle's extremely quiet. All you hear is a big whoosh of air, you know? And, uh,. Oh man, I tell you, that trigger is so smooth. It's like butter. So, uh, yeah. So now I just got to break it in. You know? But it's, it's, a, it's a hell of a rifle, man. Let me tell you. It's just gorgeous looking. Let me try to zoom it in one more time for you guys. Look at that there, eh? That's just a beautiful piece right there. Yeah, so this thing, this thing is a beast. You know? Well, I think I covered everything. Um, I hope you like the rifle. I certainly do. And thanks for watching.